All right, homies and homies, before we start this video, just want to let you know, Sunday, December 31st, 3 p.m. Central Time, we are releasing the Ragtop Scoop Necks in black and gray. We got the new Tribal End t-shirt, Icy Blue, and the other colors restocked, and three new backless shirts for the ladies. 15% off code will be pump15 and yes the comp the code is also good the checkout code is also good at getholeready.com as always thank y'all for your support and here's the What's video good, YouTube you know who it is Chris Jones representing Pump Chasers and it is Friday night I'm probably gonna have this video up Saturday morning uh, before we start the uh, video I want to introduce you to somebody who's gonna be joining me for legs right here Hi. Michelle Future <laughs> pro, and uh, she's about to she's prepping for a show right now. Today is her leg day, so I'm like, hey, come join me for legs. Let's train legs together. I can use motivation. She can use a little motivation because it's Friday night. Everybody's out partying, That's and right. we're about to go over here and get it in. This is our bar tonight. We're going to the bar, but not that kind of bar. You feel me? <laughs> so tell them where they can find you on Instagram. I'm putting her Instagram in the description in case I want to give her a follow. My Instagram, uh, it's Mishka, M I S C K A A A. Um, that's it? That's it. That's it. <laughs> Don't forget, link to her Instagram in the description. Y'all want to show a little support, follow her prep journey. When's that show again? It's April 7th. April 7th, man. And we're in which state is it going to be? We're going to be out here or what? It's going to be out here, um, it's the Ronnie Coleman. Oh, that's a big show. Yep, big Hey, one. Ronnie Coleman, April. Fuck with her. All right, so we're about to get my knee sleeves on, guys. Get my mind right. And we'll see you at the squat rack. All right, homies and home mets. So you should already know, full routine is written at the very bottom of the description for the ones that happen to give a fuck. All right, so we started off the leg workout with some hip abductor and adductor work. We did five sets high reps, like 12 to 15 reps per set. I did not record myself doing this, but take my word for it, I did it, all right? Then we got straight into leg extensions that really get a nice pump in the quads. Warm up, the, warm up the knees as well, all right? People ask a lot about separation in the quads. This exercise right here is great for separation in the quads. Just use good form and don't try to go crazy heavy, okay? This is the isolation movement. So we decided to get into squats, all right? Michelle did back squats and I did front squats and we pretty much just chose some weight that was challenging enough to make eight to 12 reps feel challenging. I kept it at 315 for front squats. Uh, Michelle started off with one plate. It felt pretty light, so she went ahead and upped the weight to 185. And honestly, that was pretty easy for her as well. You know what I'm saying? She actually went up to uh, 205. Yeah, she went up to 205. I didn't record the set, but take my word for it, man. She did 205 and made it look like butter. All right, this right here is the 185 set. She got this shit like, like 10, like 10 or 12 times. Like I said, she did 205, but we didn't record it, man. We actually work out for real. We don't just record videos with, you know, super slow motion and shit to look like we are working out. We actually work out in this bitch, okay? So we can't record every damn set. So this right here is leg press. We kept the reps high. We did 15 reps, feet shoulder width apart. Now this right here is good for separation as well. People ask me all the time, how do you get that separation? You know how you stand to the side and you see the hamstring separated from the lateral head of the quad, you know the outside of the quads? Step ups and lunges is gonna give you that separation in detail, all right? Look at here, look at this clip right here, the last time I was lean, this was in the summertime. You see the separation in the front? And I'm gonna turn to the side in just a moment, just let you, you know, get a good look at those quads, you know. I have to zoom out a little bit so you can see that's really me in this bitch. All right, now here's a side shot right here. See how the separation from the, first off, them quads are sweeping like a motherfucker, all right, like a big ass hunk of meat, but you see the separation from the hamstrings, glutes, and quads. You get that from nice, deep lunges and step ups, which is why I have them in my programs especially the class of physique program all right so we're doing our uh lunges right here like i said keep in mind michelle is getting ready for a show so you guys kind of want to show her some uh 
you know, separation movement. I'm pretty sure she's already familiar with these movements, but you know, you definitely, if you're prepping for a show, it's all about the details and those lines, man. You gotta suck it up, even on those low carb days, and make sure you hit them legs from different angles. Going to the gym and doing some squats is not enough for competition. All right, we're doing our stiff legs right here with dumbbells. Using dumbbells so we can really get a nice deep stretch. Be sure not to go crazy heavy on these because if you go too heavy with dumbbells, your lower back tends to come in. You don't want that, all right? And the last two exercises right here is gonna be uh, hamstring curls. We did some uh, standing hamstring curls and then we did some seated hamstring curls, all right? And that's pretty much it. Don't forget, tomorrow, December 31st, 3 p.m. Central, use code POMP15 to get those new items or any other items you may have your eyes on. And don't forget, getholray.com as well. Fuck with your boy. All right, homies and homets. Post-workout meal. <laughs> she just got real, you hear me? Let me show you what we got. We at Logan Steakhouse for the ones that happen to give a fuck. I know somebody's gonna ask. <laughs> All right, Rochelle, show them what you got. I got a six ounce filet mignon oh, that looks with good. a sweet potato. There dry. we go, baby. Keep it simple. And I just got broccoli. I got those grilled shrimp and rice. Potato and a sirloin cooked medium. I'm about to fuck it up, fuck it up, fuck it up. And there it is, homies at home. And don't forget, follow the homie Michelle, man. She said she want to hear back with me soon, so you might be seeing her again, all right? She's a fucking beast. And as always, don't forget to like my shit. Buy 30 of them bitches, because Bruno needs those treats. And you holler back at your boy. Minimum.